Hello, this is Dr. Alia Al Shadidi from Trio Dentistry, your dental office in Mississauga. In this video, I'm going to talk about halitosis, which is bad breath. Do you know that chronic bad breath affects one out of four people to some degree? This may have a negative impact on persons' business interactions, social relationships, and dating experiences, and personal self-esteem. Transient mouth odor could be caused by aromatic foods like garlic and onions. Tobacco use is another common cause of mouth odor. However, our main concern is chronic bad breath. So, what causes chronic bad breath? Number one, poor oral hygiene, which causes a film of bacteria forms on the teeth. This causes cavities and gum disease. Number two, old dentures or poorly fitting dentures, crowns, and bridge work. Another cause of halitosis is xerostomia or dry mouth, which is mostly related to some medications, side effects like medications used to treat high blood pressure, anxiety and depression, and hundreds of other medications. A condition called ketosis, which is found in some people with certain type of diets, is another cause of bad breath. Last but not least, bad breath could be a side effect of a serious health problems like diabetes, chronic bronchitis, liver and kidney disorders. How do you treat bad breath? Number one, brush twice a day and don't forget to brush your tongue. Floss to remove the hidden bacteria and food particles in between your teeth. Denture wearers, remove your denture before bed, cleanse them thoroughly and if they are poorly fitting, just get the new dentures. Drink plenty of water throughout the day. Staying hydrated helps keep a healthy amount of saliva in the mouth. Visit your dentist on a regular basis. That helps you to keep good oral hygiene and prevent situations that can cause bad breath like cavities and gum disease. The best control of bad breath is good oral hygiene. Mouthwashes and breath sprays are mostly cosmetic and don't have a long-lasting effect. Breath mints generally contain sugar or citric acid. When allowed to dissolve slowly in the mouth, they are actually decay-producing. So keep good oral hygiene. 